Well, Ed Maria, it was a sight that stopped a couple walking through Broadmoor Wildlife Sanctuary right in their tracks. A goose with goslings with an arrow right through its body. Now they're hoping someone will do something to help. And we noticed that just something looked off with one of them where its its gait was a little funny. Laura Moody and her wife were walking through Broadmoor Wildlife Sanctuary in Natick over the weekend when this goose caught their attention. And then we were like, oh my God, that's, that's an arrow. It's, it's going directly through that goose. The green and white feathers from the arrow were visible in the goose's front. As it turned the corner, we could see where that the front of the arrow had gone all the way through it to the back. The couple stopped to take photos, noting the time and location, hoping to give the information to wildlife experts who could help. There was no way we were going to you know, have any positive outcome by trying to, you know, capture the goose, get the, the arrow. We were just like, let's, we just need to notify somebody. After getting wildlife experts on the phone, Moody learned there was not much anyone could do to help the goose. It feels like somebody should at least go look for it or something. I don't know. According to Mass Audubon's website, all land at wildlife sanctuaries is protected, saying there's no fishing, hunting, trapping, or releasing of animals. Now, Laura Moody is left wondering if something more could have been done. Now what? Do we just wait until that goose? I, I don't, you know, I, I, what happens now? Now, I reached out to Mass Audubon about the situation and what could be done. They deferred me to Mass Wildlife, who has not returned my calls or email. Reporting live in Natick, Emily Maha, WCVB News Center 5.